I would want to show, I would want to give a huge thank you to the ride mates. All, all of you have done a wonderful job, and might I add, you guys look fantastic. I would also like to say, Laura, you look beautiful. And Victor, well, he just looks petrified. I have uh, decided to take a different approach to my speech, for I am not the best person to give martial advice. Therefore, I have a few uh, words of wisdom to say. The uh, first piece of advice I would like to give you is the rules and establish who's the boss. <laughs> After you have done that, be sure to do whatever she says. Uh, my second piece of advice can be compared to baseball. Be committed every week and never strike out. <laughs> and always remember, if you bring home flowers, she will automatically think you're guilty. Uh, for you, Laura, I have five things to keep uh, for you, Laura, I have five things to keep in mind to ensure that your marriage is a successful one. A husband who will shower you with gifts and compliments. He will grant you every request. He will comfort you in times of need. He will treat you. He will treat you right and always stand by your side. I would like to say that I, uh, I know Victor for over 16 years. The first time I met Victor, I knew we had a connection. Maybe it was a Polish thing. <laughs> We've been uh, through a lot together, from happy to angry, sad to angry. <laughs> like the time I punched you and I ran away, <laughs> you, ch you chased me and I locked up my, uh, my knee in the middle of the street and I almost got hit by a car. <laughs> yeah, good times. I remember when you got drunk in, uh, in an hour in Vegas and I had to carry you up to your room so you could go up for, uh, for round two. When we played paintball, you always had my back. But over the years, you've been like a brother to me, to thick and thin. When I was down, you brought me up. When I was unhappy, you made me laugh. When I got drunk and passed out, you carried me to bed. <laughs> There's a lot more to say, but I must say that I couldn't be more happier for you and wish you many years of happiness in years to come. Victor is a very fortunate man because he married Laura. I mean, let's be honest, she's the only one who put up with this crap. <laughs> so, uh, Laura Beck, love you guys with all my heart. <laughs>